So there are some churches out there, for some reason, think women should not be in priesthood. I don't get it. <laughs> I simply do not get it. Not only am I a woman in priesthood, but my mother was ordained when I was seven years old. So for basically everything I can remember since my childhood, there have been women preaching and teaching and performing sacraments and providing ministry in all sorts of ways. And I am certainly not damaged because of it. Here's the issue with churches that don't ordain women. And this should not come as a surprise to anyone. The only reason that I can think of why women are not ordained in other churches is control. That's all it is. Control. Churches that don't ordain women are ridiculously scared of losing control. Control over women. Control over money. Control over their congregants ability to get into some heaven that they have created. Whatever it is, I am over it. I am done with that sort of Neanderthal thinking. These churches are living in fear. Fearful over what might happen if they let go of control just a little bit. What they don't know, what they don't understand, and what sadly they might never understand is that God lives in those uncontrolled places. God lives in the places that are just a little bit wild, where the Spirit can breathe and move. Some people like to think that God is a controlling God, an authoritarian God, but it's simply not true. God calls us to do and be like God. But God does not demand it. God merely urges us, gently nudges us. And then we get to decide what, hopefully, wild path we will follow. Also, and perhaps more importantly for us to realize at this moment, is that priesthood is not a lifting up to authority over people. Priesthood and community of Christ is actually a lowering down. At its very core, priesthood is servant ministry. This is the kind of priesthood that Jesus practiced. Washing feet, healing the sick, touching those who are untouchable. This is Jesus-centered servant ministry. This ministry has provided me with some of the most beautiful experiences of my life. This ministry is where souls meet and where we start to see those thin places, those liminal spaces, the spaces between the familiar and that unknown between controlled and wild. And it is stunning. It is simply the most breathtaking thing. And everyone should be able and is able to experience that. So let it go. Let go of the idea that God only calls one type of person to be in ministry and priesthood. It's simply not true. While not everyone is in priesthood, everyone is called to be in ministry. All are called to discern God's will for their lives and to practice those things. So go, do it. Live in those uncontrolled, wild places where God is your life will most certainly change. And you can thank me later for it. As always, please feel free to leave a comment, a share, a like, or ask a question. We always get lots of questions about priesthood ministry and community of Christ. I would love to answer them and to also hear what you have to say.